Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And if you have recently updated your Google Pixel 6, 6a, or the 6 Pro to the latest and greatest Android 13, and now you are having battery drain issues on your device, that is what we are going to try and fix in this video. So, the first thing we are going to do is we will go into settings. Once you are in settings, you will go into apps. Here in select see all apps. Then select three dot menu on the top right and here and make sure you select show system. Once you have selected show system, the next thing we are going to do is tap on this search icon on the top right, right besides the three dot menu. Here in, first of all, we are going to search for health now once you search for health something called device health services is going to show up so we are going to select device health services you will go into storage and cache herein you will go into manage space and select clear all data and on the next pop-up screen we are going to say okay once that is done we can go back and we are on the application list one more time tap on the search icon once again and now we are going to search for well-being once you search for well-being something called digital well-being is going to show up repeating the same process go into storage and cache herein you need to select clear storage and say delete all the data then we can go back again on the main list of applications this time around we are going to search for something called intelligence now once you search for intelligence you will see android system intelligence select this go into storage and cache manage space and we are going to say clear data and also we are going to say all the time and if you want to clear your now playing history you can do that as well i am not doing that for now so once you have selected all time say clear data so this has cleared all the data for android system intelligence as well next thing we are going to do is we will go back into settings go into network and internet select your internet connection here in select internet preferences and make sure you disable this toggle notify for public networks disable this because in the background it is scanning for open wi-fi networks we do not want that it causes battery drain on the pixel 6 6a or the 6 pro next thing you need to do is make Make sure that your adaptive battery is enabled so you will go into settings then you will go into battery adaptive preferences make sure these two toggles are enabled and do note that with pixel devices it learns your usage over time so to get the best battery backup use your device normally for a week and then the pixel device is going to learn your usage pattern and adjust it automatically which is why we want those two toggles to be turned on next thing i recommend you do is make sure you go to the play store tap on your initial on the top right and herein you can go into your manage app and devices then go into updates available and make sure you have updated all the applications like your android system intelligence if you have an update for play services play store make sure you get the latest app version because google is aware of these battery drain issues and if there are any applications which are causing them which are owned by google then they push out updates so again make sure all your google applications are updated to the latest version next thing i recommend you do is turn off adaptive connectivity how do you do that you can go into settings network and internet scroll down you have adaptive connectivity you can turn this off it only improves your performance by automatically managing your network connections now i'm pretty sure once you leave your home there is no wi-fi it will switch so adaptive connectivity you can turn it off another thing i recommend you do is turn off the option of mobile data always active in developer options so how do you do that you will go into settings then you will go into about phone 
once you are in about phone scroll down all the way you will see something called build number tap on this seven times and if you have a pen setup it will ask you to enter a pin now once you've entered your pin enabled developer options go back into settings and then you will go into system and herein you will see something called developer options that means the option has been enabled now go back into your settings and herein you can search for something called data always active as soon as you type that data always active you will see an option for that mobile data always active in developer options select this and disable this toggle because we do not want mobile data to be active even when we are using wi-fi no need I mean the one second or two second delay in switching between Wi-Fi and mobile data I think is a better choice than having excessive battery drain on your Google Pixel. Then the other thing you can do is monitor what apps are draining battery. So if you go into settings, battery, battery usage for the last 24 hours, it will show you what app has been draining your battery. Now applications like Facebook, Facebook Messenger and other social media applications are known to drain your battery. My personal recommendation to you is use the light version of Facebook or Facebook Messenger if you have to use those applications then if you disable your now playing that will also help you save some battery so you can go into settings sound and vibration here and you have now playing so what this is doing is if this toggle is enabled it is going to be listening and then if any music or song is playing around you it will recognize it and then it is going to display it on your lock screen pretty cool feature to have and as per google it drains minimal battery but it does drain some battery so if you are not using this feature then it is a good choice to disable this toggle as well and last but not the least if you are using either the google pixel 6 or the google pixel 6 Pro and you're not using your pixel stand you can disable that app as well so you can go into settings apps and here in see all apps again three dot menu on the top right make sure you have show system enabled and then when you search over here you need to search for stand once you search for stand you will see an application called pixel stand if you are not using the pixel stand to wirelessly charge your google pixel 6 or the google pixel 6 pro feel free to disable this application as well and once you select disable it will ask you one more time disable the app if you ever feel the need to enable it you can always go back into the same option and then enable that pixel stand application and last but not the least if you do have the samsung health app installed on your google pixel because you have a samsung galaxy smartwatch make sure it is not draining a lot of battery and if it is on top of your battery use it charge you can always go into the application info go into permissions and for this physical activity make sure you select don't allow and that should help reduce some battery drain on your google pixel 6 devices and there it is peeps those were some tips and tricks on how to reduce the battery drain on your google pixel 6 google pixel 6 pro or the google pixel 6a after installing android 13 and of course if the video helped you do let me know via comments below if you do have any other tips and tricks which helped you save battery or the battery drain was fixed on your device 